In order to do this activity, it's best that you set up the overhead before class. It's important that the overhead light is focused at the distance that you are putting it from the wall. So the first thing you should do, find a place in your room that you can make as dark as possible. The darker, the better. Take a transparency, put it on your overhead. Make sure that your overhead is as close as you can get it, but that it is still focused. Once that's done, We'll take some sort of colorful poster, anything with a lot of color, put it in the center of where the light is shining. Then, remove the transparency, turn off the overhead, get a white piece of paper, and you're ready to go. When the students come in, what you're going to give them are the flashlights. The more flashlights, the darker, the better it is, and the more of your image will show up on the paper on the overhead. What you're modeling is how the eye works. When you see red, it's actually red light, is, the light is reflecting and the red of the spectrum is entering your eye and registering in the back. So when you shine more of these on here, more of the red or the yellow is reflecting into the eye. You can also use a small desk lamp to do the same thing. You put it down to the side, it lights up the whole thing, and then you'll see it down here. The next thing I'll show you is how that looks when you're looking down at this in the dark. With the lights out, this is with two flashlights. You can see how at the bottom I actually can trace the edge of the poster and you can see the different colors of the poster. This is why the more flashlights you add, the better the image will be. Another way of doing it is with the bright light. There's your desk lamp and what you're looking at is that piece of paper on the overhead and the colors being reflected down through the lens onto the white piece of paper to model how the eye registers color. When you see red, it's because red light is being bounced off of the object into your eye. 